Heights, Ray. Cynthia? Six feet apart. <laughs> okay, Cynthia, top three questions we get in the recycling world. Question number one for you, ready? Yes, I'm ready. All right, why do I have to take things to the depot? Oh, well, that's a good question. Uh, there's lots of items that go to a depot, so styrofoam, glass, soft plastics, like plastic bags, and over wrap. And the main reason is to have those source separated by our residents so that they're really clean when they get to the recycling plant, easier to market. Uh, glass, you know, when it's mixed with other recycling, creates a hazard breaks and that kind of thing. So we like to keep that nice and separate. Um, so, but really it's about uh, having good, clean product to get to market. Okay, another one for you. Question number two, if it has that recycling symbol on it, does that mean for sure it's recyclable? Uh, not always. So our program is all about paper and packaging. So you have to look at it in terms of is this packaging? And so that's the first thing you need to answer. And then if it is packaging, is it going in my cart or is it a depot only uh, item? So there's lots of plastic products out there that do have that loop, but because they're a product, they're not acceptable. All right, question number three, how do I find out more information? <laughs> well, we have uh, lots of information on our website at rdco.com and we have a fantastic app. That's why I'm holding my phone. On our right. smartphone and uh, Recycle Coach is the name of the app and it has your garbage schedule, your recycling schedule and a really great uh, what goes where search tool. Oh, look at that, it's my garbage day today. <laughs>